team the other day. But that's just that was the nature of just how kind of crazy it was. Really, um, it was just a crazy, crazy game. Yeah, and you just wonder from there, can the championship keep getting better? And where are you at with this GA Go thing? Because it costs four million a year to run it. Um, GA puts eighty three percent of whatever they make. This is according to Jared Burns and Claire Byrne this morning. Puts eighty three percent straight back into it. Do you feel like people deserve to have it totally for free? And you know, ultimately, if we don't have someone else carrying it, how is it supposed to carry in the TV rights? How is it supposed to wash its own face if if everything is that's good is put out for free and people aren't willing to pay for something that doesn't have the big games? Yeah, no, I I actually don't have the issue with paying for it per se. Um, I probably have the issue with paying for something that's you can't get everywhere in the country. You know what I mean? If I pay for that and it's a, just say it's a subscription channel on my television, then I know it's going, like, it's going to be perfect. I turn it on and it's there and it's going to be, there's going to be no issues. But there are plenty of areas in the country where you pay for a subscription and you cannot see what you're paying for. I also have an issue with the games that were, some of the games that were having on terrestrial television and some of them that were not, like, I know the provincial finals have to be carried, the four f- football provincial finals. Are you telling me that one of them couldn't have been, you know, or two of them couldn't have been on a Saturday to accommodate, you know, the hurling bin on a Sunday or plan it out a bit better? Like having two weekends in a row where there was no hurling when you're right in the middle of, you're in the meaty part of the best part of the hurling championship, realistically, and go down through the years. The Munster Championship, the last, particularly since the round robin, but even maybe before then, that is has been the best part of the hurling championship, or one of the best parts. And we've kind of just put that away where a hell of a lot of people can't see it. Um, and like, I'm, I'm not tech savvy, savvy 